<laughs> Welcome back to the channel, guys. All right, so in the last episode of Masters 25, I said I'm not going to open. Or I said I'm going to keep opening Masters 25 until I pull a Jace. And it was on the very last pack. And then I cracked the Jace. It was, it was ridiculous because I had like four boxes of this already. And I had yet to open a Jace. And I'm just like, what are the odds of that? Like, come on, really? Four boxes, not one Jace? So... There's that. But still, I believe this is a good product to purchase for, if you can get it for under 140 bucks. I think that's just about what I paid for this, maybe 135, 140. Not bad at all. And we just pulled a Jace yesterday also, by the way. Pretty neat. Um, real quick, just wanna give a shout out to a few of my ninjas out there. It's Spencer McLaughlin, Cody DeBell, Josh Onick, Jacob Narr, Christopher Flanagan, Philip Hamilton, Doug Schaefer, Trenton, can't open this. Trenton Schaefer, oh, I'm sorry, Trenton Vigil. Uh, Radu Emanuel, Jake Milk, J.D. Anglin, Michael Brennan, Yuri, DeVries, Jake Mitchell, Andrew Pilgrim. You guys are all pretty sweet. One more second. Oh, my. Pete George as well. Matthew Waters, Frank Airy, Carolyn Harper, Joshua Hornback, Daz Berserker. You guys are the bomb, diggity. I appreciate y'all. Protein Hulk. I do want to make a deck with him, but isn't he banned in like a bunch of formats? Giant Growth Foil. That's legit. Isn't he banned in a bunch of formats? I think he is. I don't know. Because he's just like a little cheap. A little cheaper. Move these up a little bit. What is the artwork on this card? Look at that. What the heck? Really? That looks goofy. Why do he look so goofy? I don't get it. Alright. I don't know. Uh, this is like the worst artwork ever. Is it just me, or I mean, is that artwork bad? Ancient Craving. There you go. Promise. Ooh, is it Chemister? Oh, an Exotic Cavern. We got the old Morph Produce. It's a foil. That's not a bad-looking foil, though. We'll take it. So there is hype. There is a new kind of Master set, you can say. It's the Mythic Edition. I just beat the hell out of that last card. I'm sorry about that, Craggy. Ooh, we got an Anix Survivalist. Don't ask why I'm going backwards this time. Oh, but we pulled a Vendillion Click when we give it a little trick. That's sweet. I have opened so many Vendillion Clicks, it's not even funny. Uh, Casualties, Myriad Landscape, and a Blue Elemental Blast. Skink. All right, cool. And the rest are going to be commons, obviously. Maybe I can go from the back this time. I wonder how quick I can go through a box if I do it that way. Not that I'm in a hurry, but... Bam! Our foil is Ember Weaver. We'll take it. And as, wow, that is really off-centered. Good card, though, <laughs> but wholly off-centering. I mean, look at that. That's, like, not good. That's terrible. If you think that's a misprint, no, it's, it's or a, a miscut, no. It, that, yeah, they definitely miscut that, but that's, like, just damaged. That looks stupid. That stinks. Uh, I kind of want my money back on that. Uh, Quicksilver, Merfolk Looter, Mishra's Factory. All right, there's that. Azusa, Lost of Seeking. Great card. So that, we just got two really good back-to-back -back pools. With a Haunted Fengraf to punt. Nice. And a Grenzo, Dungeon Warden. Okay. There's the Uncommon Pile, so you guys can see. You guys don't like it when I do it that way, do you? Do you, want, do you really want to see all the... You, you want me to go through them and you see all the commons first? All right. Fine. We'll do it that way. That's fine. So we have a heavy Arbalist. Ravenous Chupacabra, great card. Utopia Sprawl, another great uncommon. Master of the Wild Mythic. All right, cool. That was a good pack. Uh, Congregate for our foil slaughter. Unfortunately, Master of the Wild Hunt is not the mythic we wanted. So we got a Vendillion Click right now and a Master of the Hunt. Okay. That's, that, that's it. I'm just saying okay. That's all. I don't know, I think we could have done a little better than that. Curiosity, Street Wraith, Invigorate, Hannah Ship's Neap Eater, and a Man of War Foil. Nice. I think that's a fourth Man of War Foil we've pulled. A bad boy gaming, this is true. We got Epic Confrontation. We have the Null. Swift, Reef Worm. Can't get enough of my Reef Worm. Ancient Stirrings. It's not bad. Not a bad uncommon. Is that going for anything? You guys know if them ancient stirrings are going for anything? I just can't recall if they are or not. Not sure. 
cool artwork on that guy. Rancor, can't get enough Rancors ever. Ball Lightning, good card, can't get enough of those. And a Frenzied Goblin to close out that pack. What is it, Mythic Edition? That's what it is. It's a Mythic Edition. So that's coming out pretty soon here. Yes, I'm stupid. I'm going to buy a box of it. Even though I talked some smack about the product. Conflux, I just really don't like Conflux. Uh, Balduvian Horde, cool. I don't know. I, come on. They're, if they're, they're not Planeswalker masterpieces. They're just like little tiny upgraded Planeswalkers. Um, that's really all they are. They're nothing special. Like, I, I don't think they're special. I don't, oh, man, I don't know. Ooh, a foil. Hell's Caretaker. <laughs> that's cool. Sacrifice a creature. Return target creature card from a graveyard to the battlefield. Activate its ability only during your upkeep. That's, that could be ridiculous, though. You, sacri you could sacrifice a 1-1 one, one and then return Emrakul. What the hell? All right. I mean, that's cool. Maybe I'll work that in a deck. Is that even legal? Is that legal in modern? Anyone know? But yeah, Mythic Edition. I don't Hype's real on it, guys. I don't know. Brainstorm's a cool common. I just don't see. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know enough. Flooded Grove. Okay, that's not bad. With a Merfolk Looter. Merfolk's in standard stink. And I think Wizards gave up on them. They're like, yeah, these are just so bad. We just, we're just done printing Merfolk right now. Valor and a quarter. Yeah. Some Lightning Bolt. Akroma's Vengeance. We'll take it. And a full, oh my god! <laughs> Smack myself. Oh, oh, that is nasty. That is so nasty. Oh, we'll do it one time. Oh my god, oh my god. This <laughs> scary branch is such a good card. Wow. Only on Bad Boy, man, do we open all the good stuff. I'm telling you, punch that like button in the face. Oh, my gosh. In all its glory. And snaring bridge. Foil. Mythic. Stupid good. Wow. Oh. Jesus. Jeez, man. I don't... Man, oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That probably paid for like half the box, maybe more. No, I don't. That might have paid the box. I don't even know what those go for. I know they're not cheap though. Holy smokes, man! And a fortune thief. That might be my best pull so far out of one of these boxes. And uh, I don't know what I just did with my comments. There we go. Wow, uncaged fury. That ensnaring bridge. Woo! Loaded, loaded, Miss Jefferson. Loaded, loaded. Get a load of that in church. Mm -mm. Sunday, bloody Sunday. I'll tell ya. Darian, King of Jeldor. With a foil, why did they print you Colossal Dreadmaw? Oh, because they were doing one from each set. I get it. Man, that ensnaring bridge. I can't get over that pool. I mean, what was your guys' best pool? Um, that was my best pool in a while, I'd have to say. That, that trumps a lot of pools recently. Oh my gosh. Hell's Caretaker non-foil. Something with a foil knight of Skyward Eye. Cool artwork on that. Yeah, what is your best pull? Um, I'd say the last two months. Give me your best pull of the last two months. I think in the last two months that was my best pull right there. Remarkable, remarkable pull there. Congregate, bink, 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 and a Brian's with a horror of the broken lands. All right, oh my gosh, I still can't get over that. We just pulled that. That's what we call a case hit here. And Bad Boy Gaming Land. Stampede Driver. All up in it. Zeta. Zeta. It's a, it's a myth. It's a rare in other sets. Living Wish. We got a Living Wish. Not bad. Noble Templar. All right. Not the strongest pack there. What's a Living Wish go for? You may choose a creature or a land card you own from outside the game. Reveal that card and put it into your hand. Wow. That's pretty nasty. Fun little trick there. That's not like legal and modern, is it? It's crazy if it is. Sundering Titan. Ugh, I just don't like you. I really just don't like you. Uh, Phyrexian Ghoul. There you go. Nah, Sundering Titan's alright, but I don't know. I don't know. There we go. Artwork on it's god awful, though. Red Elemental Blast, Angelic Page, Plague Wind. There you go. And a Twisted Abomination. You know, we only, I think I only pulled, we got three mythics, but only two real mythics. The other one's a foil, so. I think there might be, no, did we pull three already? 
think two. I don't know. One might be hiding still. I don't know. Might have one creeping around here. Ah, oh, not you again. Rurik Thar. Horseshoe crab. Ugh. Well, this dried up worse than my date last night. Goodness gracious. Just kidding. That, that was a joke. That never happened, by the way. All right, good. <laughs> that, that was a joke. Uh, Coalition Relic. Nice. Oh, and a Prophetic Prism. Legit. Legit. Actually, I did have a date earlier in the day with my buddy, Chris, from Warzone Matrix. We did go out for a short while. I guess you can call that a bro date, man. We had a bro date. Living death. Living death. With a regrowth. Closing this, closing this, closing, closing this box out. And what are we going to get on the last one? Got to get something good. Come on, baby. Gotta get something good. Ancient stirrings. Oosh, oosh. Ah, perfect indeed. Phantasmal bear to finish her out. All right, I mean, that's something. We'll take it. Something's better than nothing, baby. All right, there it is. Guys, make sure you go ahead and punch that like button. This was stupid. That is snowing bridge. You are gorgeous. Uh, I love you guys. As always, PLA.